Hey there everyone, it's Misty here from the Jolly Fat Elf. Happy Friday! Welcome back to another card. Today I'm using the Cauldron Bubble Bundle. I'm using this little trick-or-treat stamp, but then I use the framelit that coordinates with this girl, the little witch, to cut out the designer series paper so I don't have to color. So I've done all of the work ahead of time to make this a little bit of a quicker video. I know that you guys are busy on Fridays. So I've already cut out the girl from the designer series paper, like I said. I also used the second to largest label from the Blended Seasons bundle. Today is the last day for you to pick this up, August 31st. After this, it will no longer be available for purchase. So I cut this out of Granny Apple Green. I stamped the sentiment in Gorgeous Grape and used the smallest circle from the Stitch Shape Framelits in order to cut that out. For my card base, I have another piece of Granny Apple Green that measures four and a quarter by 11. I've scored it at five and a half. Don't forget, you can head over to the coordinating blog post, which you'll find linked down below. If you are on mobile, to the right of the, um, excuse me, to the right of the title, there is a little down arrow, click that. If you are on desktop, laptop, etc., you can click the show more. Down there, you will find links to the blog post, my Patreon, uh, social media, <laughs> Stampin' Up! store, all the things that you need to find me on the World Wide Web. I have some layers here. I have a piece of gorgeous grape that measures four and an eighth by five and three eighths, and one that measures two and an eighth by five and three eighths. Then my layers are just an eighth of an inch smaller, so they measure four by five and a quarter. You can see some more of those little cute little witches on this paper. So cute. This whole suite it is so cute. Love it. The holiday catalog goes live on September 5th, I believe. I'm pretty sure it's Wednesday the 5th. Whatever Wednesday is. <laughs> Don't have my phone in front of me. Oh no. This is why I use liquid glue. <laughs> I don't have my phone in front of me, but I'm pretty sure it's the bit. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. I know you will. And I appreciate it. Go ahead and get this added. Green, purple, and orange are classic Halloween colors. And even if you don't see them in the designer series paper, that doesn't mean that you can't add, add them to your card. I love this hat pattern, so cute. And the hat from the framelits cuts out this hat. And of course you guys know I love this little froggy from, from Tuesday. Thanks again for you guys for being so patient with me as I recover from whatever Whatever stomach bug I caught, I'm gonna add some gorgeous grape ribbon, I think. Yeah, let's add some ribbon. Bring in some washi tape. If I could get it straight. I'm going to go ahead and adhere this flat. Like 
Then in here, my label using dimensionals. Here, our little witch with dimensionals as well. Along with our sentiment. Gonna add a bow and then with some glue dots and then this card will be done. guys that's it thank you so much for joining me today i hope you enjoyed this card as much as i enjoyed making it don't forget that today is the last day to pick up the blended seasons bundle it's also the last day to earn bonus days cash so for every 50 dollars you spend in the month of august you'll get a coupon for five dollars that you can use in september excuse me the holiday catalog goes live next week everything will be linked down below if you are in the states i hope you have a fun and safe labor day weekend I will see you guys on Monday for a new week of cards. Bye for now.